Hi there, it's Peter here again, the guy who hates tomatoes but loves front-end development. In today's video, I'm super excited to show you a couple of the demos from the upcoming React workshop. I want to show you exactly what will you learn inside of the React workshop and we will go through the first two demos. The first one is currency converter and the second one is using Google Maps. It's like a property listings where we see the pins, we're listing, we're filtering through the properties. So I want to show you both these two demos in more detail and I also give you the link so you can check out the project. It's uploaded live, you can check it out. The first one is a currency converter which converts, which takes the data from a, from a JSON object. So we're not calling any external APIs, we're simply saving a local JSON object and loading it into the state and then we converting the Australian dollars into any currency from the list. Okay, so the user can select different currency. Everything is automatically on the fly recalculated. You can enter any value in the Australian dollar input or into the other input. I call it currency A, currency B and everything, as I said, is automatically recalculated, saved into the state. While working on this demo, you will learn how to take an input, how to make a simple calculation, and how to update everything based on the current state. It might look simple, but if you're not sure how you would build something like this with React, then this part of the workshop is exactly for you. The second project is this cool property listing on Google Maps. And then we have this filter in the top right where you can filter by the number of bedrooms, bathrooms, car spaces. You can also toggle and change the price range and sort out from the cheapest to the most expensive or the opposite. Okay, there's also clear button which clears everything. So you see all the properties as at the beginning. And on this project, you will learn, you will master how to render a list and how to filter through it. Okay, based on some conditions. So we have a custom method which updates our listing and then we're displaying and hiding the related properties. Okay, I think this is very cool. So if you're struggling with how to use rendering and filtering inside of React, this workshop or this part of the workshop will be very, very helpful. Okay, so these are the two demos from the upcoming React workshop. I'm super excited to keep working on the rest of it. So this week, as I said, we're taking a break from coding. I just wanted to give you a little update on what's coming up. If you have any questions or if you have suggestions for any other demos that should be included in the React workshop, let me know. Here is a quick preview of the other demos that I have planned. And these ones might not make it, might make it. So if you want to see some of these demos inside of the workshop, let me know. At the moment, I'm just going through them from left to right. If you leave some good suggestion under the video, I will might include it as well, okay? I'm trying to make this workshop exactly like I made all other workshops, so it's based on your suggestions. So really want to hear what you think should be one of the demos and one of the projects inside of the React workshop. So let me know in the... That is the call to action. Go to the comments and let me know what exactly, what specifically would you like to see and learn in some of the demos in the React workshop. And that's it all for me today. Now it's a coffee time. Now it's for me time to get some caffeine and keep working on the following demos, on the next demos. And if you haven't already, sign up to the email list so you don't miss the launch of the React 101 and React workshops. And now it's the coffee time. That coffee, coffee is good, coffee is good guys. If you don't drink coffee, you should start. Sorry where this is going. <laughs> start up the tripod now. A little bit of milk into the coffee. There's no milk in the fridge. So I need to have a little short black, short black. Does anyone drink short black? How do you like your coffee? Actually, that's another call to action. Let me know what you want to see in the React workshop or how do you like your coffee, okay? I want to see plenty of comments. How do you like your coffee, guys? Today I like mine as a short black because I don't have any milk. <laughs>
So go to the comments and let me know. Do you like a short black, long black, latte, cafe latte, white, white, uh, what is it? White, uh, white, 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 flat white, flat white, <laughs> baby chino, cappuccino. Let me know in the comments and I'll see you in my next video.